Okay, um, hi. Yeah, the face cam's gone, because I don't want to deal with that right now, plus... I don't want it, and there's a window behind me, so you'd be blind anyway. So, let's just get right into this. Riddle School 5. It already looks up great. Oh, man, the obviously main menu thing is gone. And they updated this thing, too. Okay. Main menu. Quit. Credits. Disclaimer. Instructions. And play game. Ah! <laughs> anyway, let's play. This game's really long, so let's- I'm gonna try to get through this. Well, every- Well, everyone, it seems soon our dreams will become reality, just as all of our prisoners' real realities have become dreams. We all know our new prisoners were taken from Riddle Elementary School. Enlighten our listeners as to the reason we are here already. I was getting to that part, Fizz. This meeting is primarily to discuss these human suspects and their new dreams. Their behavior, after all, is why we, and how we are going through with our plan. Yes, because evildoers deserve nothing but the, the taste of their own evil. This is Fred. We can read the captions next to the coordinates. Oh, <laughs> Fred, male. <laughs> I'm enlightening everyone, just like you said. Fred, in his dreams, does as close to nothing as he can manage. Of our prisoners, we have... He seems to be the least useful right now. I'm not good at reading these. Smiley, female. Smiley smiles constantly within her dreams. We've tried to find intended flaw in her ways, not yet to any avail. If one human is proven to be scum, the rest are no cleaner. Her face is nothing but the cover for her ugly desires. Zack, male. He's shivering. Zack here was shivering long before he was abducted from that school. It seemed impossible that he could be so ongoingly chilly. There is a chance that by looking into his unusual condition, we could power a weapon capable of freezing that pathetic planet Earth. Hmm, I could have sworn I was the one telling the presentation. Phil. No gender specified. Okay. And here we have the reason for our master plan. Had we not witnessed first-hand Phyllis- Oh, wrong accent. First-hand Phil escaping from his own school, Earth would not have become our first target of destruction. We can get into his brain, but what matters most is that we try to get out of it. Knowing the enemy is the best way of, to defeat them. Hey, uh, Diz! I can't remember what the exact plan- what the plan is exactly. Quiz, you're completely useless. Well, I can ver- clarify. With the knowledge we receive from these three dream captives, it's planned we completely freeze their homeworld, planet Earth. This procedure is to be repeated to other wrongdoing planets. I keep giving him an accent over as I read it. I have one more question. Go ahead, Quiz. When you were talking just a second ago, you said from the knowledge we received from these three dream, ga dream captives, didn't you mean to say four? Of course, just a slip of the tongue. Hey, why isn't the transmitter down dark? What if one of our subjects hears? Sorry, didn't even know it was on. It'll be turned off in a second. Okay. Ooh. Ah! <laughs> Just falling to his death. Ah! Hello, Phil. We're waking up. Force field went away. Sometimes I just go long moments of silence. But that's not a good thing. A new grounds game. Riddle School 5. Sorry if I'm not- if I should be like bugging out to any- 
dancing to any music, because I can't actually hear it. Alien coin. I'd mistake this for a quarter if it wasn't for the monster picture on it. Okay, bed. It's a bed! Puts the fine back in solitary confinement. <laughs> pillow. That's a pillow, but it feels more like a lump of a cliffs of stiff clay. Ow. Light bulb. I have a feeling that light bulb will be the only bright part of my day. I say that very lightly. Haha. <laughs> Let's get out of here. I don't think I can open that door. It's a bare and it has no doorknob. Oh, barred! <laughs> that probably means it's remote activated from the other side. Okay, what about the vent? Oh. If I wasn't screwed- if it wasn't screwed to the wall, I could move this cover and get through. Can I take the screw off? I think it's common sense, but I need something to unscrew these. Okay. The coin? Okay. Oh, I can pick up the screws, that's cool. Maybe I'll need them later, knowing these games. Okay, can I take it off now? I noticed there wasn't a fourth one, that was weird. I've decided I don't want to do that again. Okay. Duck statue. There's a button on this duck statue thing, but it doesn't seem to do anything. Okay, tile device. What's a tile? Oh! What? Oh, it's a puzzle! And I have to do these numbers at the bottom. 4701. Oh no! I made the whole thing blue. That's not what I wanted to do. Nope, that just ends up. Okay, now it's red. So if I do that and then. What? No! What? Oh, this. There we go. I got a zero. Um. And there's seven? Okay. So I have a walkthrough here, because I know these puzzles here, just for the puzzles. Um, so I'm just gonna look that up real quick. I should probably... Okay, I'm gonna reset it, so that way it doesn't mess anything up. Four, six. Oh, I got a one! Sweet! Okay. And then it said three... Okay, so I'm back at the one, and then I think you press this, and this. Yes, I got it! I got the four. Okay, that took way- that takes a really long time to be if you don't have a walk. So, oh, the statue's glowing now. Woosh, out of- whoa, out of sight, out of mind. Why did I say woosh? That's cool, I'm invisible. It's over here. Oh, guard beast. It looks kind of cute, actually. I don't want to take my chances sneaking by into the room behind it, though. Okay. What's down here? Escape pod. That's awfully tempting to just fly right out of this place. But I think my friends will uh, like me more if I saved all of them first. Wait, they're here? Oh yeah, of course they're here. What am I thinking? saying? So, I guess I... What's in here, actually? Subject 1831. It's Smiley! Ah! Oh my gosh! He got brutally zapped! I really hope there's a better way to wake up my friends. Okay, so I'm guessing they're all under those things? In their rooms? Subject... Yeah, okay. Ooh, a key card. Don't mind if I do. Wait, is there anything out of it? I see a photo of a puking gorilla under the bed. It doesn't quite tickle my fancy. Okay. Flower room. Solar light? I guess the flowers get their solar energy from the miniature star. I would most likely be a fried egg tree if I tried doing something to it. Okay. There's a potted flower. This plant's not immediately dying, so I'll take it. Immediately dying? What? Wait, what happens if I click one of these? 
Oh, it just immediately died. That makes more sense now. Apparently my green thumb loose something to be desired. Oh, tray. Oh, I can take it. Cool. Moose picture. No, you're a moose. Random picture. It's a picture of a flying pizza and a sports fanatic alien child. I can't even think of anything to say about that. Okay. Okay, um, I guess... I, I guess I explored that room. What's up here now? A room that has a pit of acid. Unreachable steak. That steak might come in handy if I could only get to it without being covered in acid. Well, that's it. I'm baffled by how the acid pool doesn't affect the wooden floor. Oh, yeah! What is this? A mirror? Door? Oh, there's a door there! That's cool. I can faintly see a hidden door at the end of the metal thing's throat. So... Wait, so that would lead this way? Oh, wait! Wait, let me see on the- There's a map here. Oh, there's a little hole, hole that connects these two rooms. So I'm gonna... What if I went out, back, into here? Hidden door! Oh, sweet! Okay. Grab the steak. Okay. What about this room? Life transference room. Um, living thing goes here, dead animal goes here. Okay, that's cool. Note. Life transfer er, machine instructions. To properly transfer life from a living thing to a dead animal, it's e as easy as one, two, three. One, put a living thing where the round arrow sign indicates. Two, put a dead animal where the other big arrow sign indicates. Three, press the arrow in the middle of the machine. Also know that the living thing dies when the dead animal comes to life. Okay. So the plant goes here and the stake goes here. Green arrow button. Pressing that arrow doesn't do anything. The machine is not. Oh. Power panel? What are those? Are those screws? Oh, they are screw holes. Okay. I need a fourth. Does the coin count? No. Do I have to find another screw? What's over here? Oh, is this Zach's room? It is. Okay. Is Maybe they're sitting under their beds. Oh, they're sitting under here. Sweet. Another screw. There's notes here. Remember to feed Oswald the monster. He only eats live meat. Nitwit. Okay. I can... Don't, I don't read cursive that well, or whatever this text is. I think it's cursive. So, this I, I just was barely able to read down. Oh, I almost forgot. He doesn't eat what he can't smell. So, find... It good what I can't read this with an aroma and put it where smell where smell can easily spread nitwit okay so Oswald the Cyclops thing only eats live meat so I'm guessing the meat has to be alive or something okay so the machine's on can I press the button now Ooh. That was simply a fail. There, I think there's a reason the meat didn't survive with the plant's life. I don't get that. What? What am I supposed to do? Maybe it has to be on the tray? No? What? What if I... Oh! You're supposed to put dirt on the tray? Oh, that makes sense, because it's like tree veins. That makes more sense. Okay, that took forever. What the heck? That's dumb. Who would ever guess that? That took forever. Place stake in a tree. Okay, now if I press it, will it work? I guess that makes more sense, because like you're transferring a plant life to it, so it has to have like roots and dirt. Now it's alive. Disgusting. It's uh, adorable. So, can I take these now? Okay. Can I feed it to you? No. It's like he can't, doesn't eat what he can't smell, so- Oh, I didn't open this yet. 
Okay, now it's open. So I can just go in here. So an aroma can be smelled. Do you, maybe a vent would do that well? That's almost a good place to put it. I mean, the aroma would likely spread. But I can't be sure the monster will stay in one place if I put the stake here. So, put it in the other side? Oh, okay. Oh, is it smell? Cool. Yeah, walking to the monster with meat aroma in the air is a brilliant idea. Wow, maybe I ought to find a plate to sit in. No! How about a place to hide? So the invisible thing? Okay, what if I go here now? Oh, he just flies back. Oh, I'm supposed to lock him in, okay. So he runs in. Lock him in? Sweet! I'm afraid dinner to go is not an option for you anymore. Sweet. So now I can go in here. What is the secret room? There's a text panel. Enter the children's dreams. In there, yeah- Oh man. I could be wrong, but this looks important. Okay, he reads it. Enter the children's dreams in their chair- In the chair in the next room. Their dreams will only end when that in them they meet doom. Something's clicking in my head. My friends are physically protected by barriers. Because of this, I can't directly wake them up. However, my dream w that I went on to college stopped when I was killed. Their dreams will only end when in them they meet doom. Which means, in order to save my friends, I have to kill them from within their dreams. Uh, uh, that's gruesome. Chair. What am I supposed to do here? Oh, number pad. What am I supposed to do with the- Oh, wait a minute! So... Um... Yeah, so is this- is, This is Zach, okay. Subject 6553. Okay, that's cool. 6553, five, five, gotta remember that. Okay, so... 6553, five, okay. I'm like, what is the number pad? Oh, wait a minute. Each of them had different numbers on their thing, so... Doesn't the number escalate by one for every prisoner? Did we all get captured, like, very separate times? Oh, accessing. Analyzing map system. Analyzation process complete. Riddle School 2, Zack Stream. Oh, this is the band room! Oh, that's cool, we're going back, like, in time, kind of. I really didn't like middle school that much. I'd like to kill Zack fast so I don't have to repeat the 7th grade. That sounded more morbid than it was supposed to. <laughs> okay, how am I supposed to kill him? Saving Zack might be a lot easier than I think it is. Do I, like, collect the coins again or something? Um... This is so cute! It's like the old art style! Can I leave? I can't leave the room, I have to kill Zack. It really is astonishing- It's really astonishing how nobody heard me say that. Shoot. Can I... Get the flu back? Okay, cool. Deja vu. <laughs> what if I use it again? Oh! Here's your whistle back, Fred. I don't know like stealing it a Um. What if I click him now? Oh! Oh, don't do it, Phil! Don't do it! Oh my gosh, that's so gruesome! No! That's so mean! Well, obviously we're saving him, but still, that's sad. Just knock him over and kill him. So I'm guessing he's awake now? Because I... did that? Zack. Ah, Zack, you're awake! I thought I died. Because suddenly I felt cold. I thought you were always cold, Zack. I mean, I really... like, really cold. Well, that doesn't matter now. We're in a space station. I can't explain everything, but there are escape pods downstairs. Oh, really? I guess I'll get going. I do a good frozen accent. Frozen voice. 
Alright, so I guess I do someone else now, so he just left with the escape pod. So if I go down, is it gone? Yeah, one's gone, okay. Subject 1831. Is this smiley? Yeah, a little smiley face in the door. 1831. 1831. 1831. I have a bad memory for something, so I'm always worried I'm gonna lose my memory in that. I usually have to, like, write it down if it's, like, a really long combination. Anyway, we're going into another dream. Is it gonna be the same thing? Accessing... Analyzing map system. Oh no, it's a different room. Analyzation process complete. Riddle School 3! Smiley's dream. Okay. That's cool. Ah, the familiar Mr. Soggy's class from my dream. If possible, I'm gonna kill Smiley quickly and painlessly. That sounds bad. But it's for a good cause? Oh! The art style! Oh my gosh! I love it. Can I grab the things back? Ruler. Got chewing gum. Can I mix these? Do the whole vent thing again? Rubber band? I don't know why. I just might help. I did do the same thing I did for the second and the Zach's thing, so... Do I... Boom! <laughs> Just goes flying into his face! I'm blind! I can't see! Do I pick back those up? I know I... You know, I don't think I'll pick those up. Okay, okay. so those must be important. Can I leave? There's not- uh, there's got to be something in this room that I could try. What if I just click her? Oh. Oh no, Soggy's glasses fell onto the floor! It sure is too bad he can't teach without them on! Oh, he's going to get it. She's going to get them, okay. What do I do? Do I click her again? <gasps> oh no! No, don't do it! No! She ate it! <laughs> she ate it! That's hilarious! Oh my gosh, that was that was scary! So oh my gosh, she ate it! Hey Smiley! Smiley, do you have any idea where we are? All I can say is that I think I just woke up from a really long dream. Sort of. We're subjects of a mind altering from what I've gathered. Oh yeah, and we're also not on the earth anymore, but I can- but that can be fixed. There are escape pods on the bottom floor of this facility. Well, that's the some- well, that's the- well, that's be something to smile about. I guess I'll see you on earth. Okay, so I guess that escape pod's gone now? Yeah. So, I'm guessing I do Phil next? Fred, I mean? 7272. I'm coming, bestie! 7272. 7272. Okay, so 7272. Okay, here we go. Which real school is this one? Accessing Analyzing Map System. Oh, is this real school four? Analyzation process complete. Riddle School Four, Fred's Dream. Cool. So Real School Four is actually an April Fool's game, by the way, for those of you who didn't know. I remember this room. Nobody's here, I think class just hasn't started yet. Wait a minute! Fred never had a seat in this classroom. So how is this his dream? Oh yeah, the alien dude was there, and everyone else. Hey Phil! What's up with the alien dude anyway? Is this Mr. McMaster's room? Uh... Yes! Yes, you're in the right place. Sweet! Cool, I just wanted to make sure I didn't get killed or something. Oh. Oh, you have no clue. Poor Fred. Okay, let me look around real quick. 
I don't have loads of time, so why would I leave the room? Why is there a big map here if we never, like, go into other rooms? I kinda want a normal Riddle School 4, that'd be cool. Desk note? From the desk of Mr. Munch. Description of Phil Eggtree given to me. Bald, looks like this. Always wears green. Okay. He needs to sit in the desk closest to the door so I can kill him. My desk? Phil's desk. Okay. So we got one thing down. So I think we're gonna make it so he thinks Fred is us, because he looks just like us. Except he's black. Can we get him to wear our sweater? Hey Fred, what's up? Would you like to wear my sweatshirt? Your sweatshirt? His, your sweatshirt is quite nice, but I actually think it's sort of hot in here. Hey, it could just be you. That, that, or there's a pit of hot of lava below the classroom. Yeah, sounds pretty good either way. Okay. Um. Have you ever seen a drilling platypus? I can't say that I have. I saw a galloping seahorse the other day, however. Drooling platypus be galloping seahorses any day of the week. Well, in that case, I hope your drooling platypus chokes on its own spit. <laughs> that face! <laughs> oh my gosh! Okay, so there's a thermostat here. Do I mess with that? The room is now relatively cold. But there's still lava. <laughs> hey, Rob, what's up? Would you like to wear my sweatshirt? I guess it is a little cold in here, and now your sweatshirt does look comfy. Alright, hand it over. I'll put it on before class starts. A few minutes later. Yeah, <laughs> I have a Newgrounds shirt. That's cool. Oh, he looks snazzy. Yeah. What do I click? I guess I just click anything, like the last game. Five! Yeah. <laughs> it's the same as the last game, because... Any- no matter what you click, it just does the same thing. Can I enter the same dream twice? That'd be funny. Ah! That's funny. Oh my gosh, so sad. He dies. Okay! So he's awake now. That should be everyone. Well, it is everyone. Unless I have a fourth friend I forgot about. Hey, Fred! Hey, Fred! Uh, hi. I don't know what's going on, do you? I know some things about altered dreams, but let's skip that part. We are in some facilities in space that's close to Earth. Conveniently for us, there are escape pods on the bottom floor of uh, this place. I knew it! You always figure everything out before anyone else does. Well, thanks for the info. It'll be great to be somewhere familiar. Sure it will, Fred. Sure it will. Okay. Finally, the game is over! Okay. My escape pod. Sweet! We're going to Earth! Oh! What the heck? Oh no! I'm being beamed up! No! Oh no, another alien ship! That's not good! Oh no! They got Smiley, Fred, and Zack! They got everyone! Seriously, what a race! This is a bit unnerving. Yeah. Marvelous, isn't it? <laughs> Comes out of the lava like a freaking super alien. I am Viz. Decide the review world's fate. Uh, nice to meet you. What exactly is going on here? Why don't you ask that cowardly traitor over there? I'll be taking this, thanks. Woo. Oh gosh, super speed's over. Whoosh. So, cowardly traitor, what exactly is going on here? Oh, green text dude, okay. I am a traitor, but not you. Oh, this is the alien dude! Sweet! 
My name is Diz. Diz, I recognize that name. And Diz, too. Were you in the meeting in the transmission before I woke up from my dream? You said you were planning to freeze planet Earth? None of this will make sense unless I start from the very beginning. It began with Vizion. Vizion was a project started by our leader Viz, the one you, you just saw. He felt that it was his duty to decide the fate of every planet in the universe. His planet by planet journey began with your planet, Earth. So it just started, basically. Nobody was in agreement to his plan, of course, but we were all under his rule. He gave his minions one chance to prove Earth wasn't worth erasing. We built a local time-stopping mine and set it outside of an Earth school. As it would turn out, the school was Riddle Elementary School, where you were. Our hope was that nobody would escape the school. Unfortunately, that day was the very same day you left the school early. Time throughout Earth stopped, and Viz was convinced Earth had evil intent. He ordered us to abduct you and your friends before restoring Earth's time. Viz and his plan to use your evils and powers against you to destroy Earth. He had to look. We had to look into your minds, hence the idea of giving you altered dreams. We even changed your clothes a few times to see if he, that affected your thoughts. Okay. So it was Viz all along with these plans. Where does your being a traitor come into the equation? So basically, Riddle School 1 is the only, like, canon one. All the others are just dreams. And then this one. Death was the only thing that could uh, separate you from your dream. Alterations to dreams can be easily detected by just about anyone. So I could only wake you up if I killed you in your dream. After all, death is the only thing that could wake any of you up. Oh! I did not go unseen, however. It was only a matter of time before I was found out. That poster! I went the full mile and altered the mind of Mr. Munch, your last dream teacher. I sat behind you and watched the execution to be sure everything went well. Okay. That is why you didn't see me when you went into the same room in the Fred's dream. By the time I was there, I... By the time... By that time, I was where I am standing now. The transmitter me The transmitter message you heard was a recording from another time. I transmitted it... I transmitted it to you again when I knew you were about to wake up. I did it so that you would know Viz's plans for your world. And now he is taking Zack's freezing genes to power up a giant laser. Not long from now it will have charged enough to freeze Earth. I have only been trying to help you so you could save your friends. Good job! Oh gosh! No, the laser's charging! Is that the laser charging? If nothing is done, your world will be a solid ice. Not cool. Sorry! Sorry, Diz, the window view is reserved for the children. Oh my gosh! He's got psychic powers, he's unstoppable! I'm so sorry I ran out of cages to trap you and your friends in. Why didn't you just trap me in with one of them or something? That would've been smart. You'll still enjoy the show, won't you? Still seems to be a lot of room in the cages. Somehow I really doubt that. I'm sure it would be an unforgettable spectacle. Which is why it, I, which is why I plan to watch it on my own ship without distraction. Prepare yourself for the grand finale. Oh gosh, you're just going back in the lava. Hey, <laughs> he left on his own ship with a little mouth. That's funny. His face. Okay, cool. No. 
No, there's another tile device! Gosh darn it, how does this one work? Oh, this one's the opposite. Instead of affecting squares next to it, it affects squares diagonal from it. What do I do here? Oh, I got the O, okay. So, get that, that, and that. There's a one, okay, sweet. That, okay, there's the four, okay. Now I just need the seven. And this? Okay, I got it, sweet. Great. What did that do? Oh, the statue things are active now. So, I can do that. Oh, they're gravity switchers, that's cool. What is this thing? Light screen? What? Oh, there's this thing here. Circle pattern. So... But it's upside down, so from the perspective... I guess it would be like this? Like that? No. I'm confused. What? That? Oh, okay. Sweet. Wait, um, that was a mug shot if I ever saw one. <laughs> Coffee mug shards. I can't reach that from here. How do I get back down? I can't reach that from here. What about this button? Oh, okay, so these buttons teleport me back. Do I have anything I could use to piece those shards together? Tooth ultra paste? Okay, um, what if I... Okay. Okay, I got it! Sweet! Now I have a... Shattered mug. What is this? Code desk? That was really easy. Holy cow. Key! Okay. What's the key for? What is this? Ooh, screws! <laughs> They're falling into the black hole of a drain. Do I take the faucet? Okay, cool. What's this wood panel here? Hardwood board. It's a wooden board. It might be covering up something, but I can't move it. Can I break it? Maybe I can melt it. Maybe if I can get the lava. What if I did scooped up lava? I want to keep safe distance from the lava if I try that. So, this? Yeah, okay, sweet. How's the mud now melting? Hot lava, hot lava java coming right up. It's amazing this mug I watched break can hold lava without melting. It is amazing, holy cow. So I'm guessing I should melt it. Open! It's not open. Oh, there's a keyhole. Oh, okay, there. What? What did that do? Oh, the panel's closing! So I can reach the steering thing now. What do I do with the steering wheel? Oh. Oh, that's cool! That's clever! We're steering it to him! The... no. Yeah, that's Viz. This is the, like, visor. Soon this planet will be covered in the coat of ice. Yes. Because evildoers deserve a taste of their own evil. Uh oh. Here we go! Ah! Whoa. <laughs> it's like a huge ball of ice and that tiny. Oh my gosh! It destroyed it! The asteroid destroyed him! Holy cow!
Amazing, you saved Earth and disposed of our wretched leader sim simultaneously. I managed to escape with this remote I found that Viz y that used to be Viz's. Maybe I can use this remote to free your hand, your friends. With all that's happened today, I that's not a bad assumption. We'll give it a go. It's worth a shot. Yay! Wee! Oh! Ow! That sucks. I'm pretty sure I now I know how to drive this ship. We're the ship we're in. You'll all be back to your homes before you know it. I'm not cold anymore. This feels amazing! <laughs> oh no! He's not cold anymore, but now he has fire! He's the opposite. I may have learned something from this experience. Friends really can come from anywhere. Even space! Aww. Cute. All my life, I've been devoted to doing as little as possible. Witnessing everything Phil has done helped me realize even a world as big as ours can be affected by what one person does. That's a good message. I guess I should say I learned a lot from this experience. But really, only one lesson I learned today really stands out to me. So we're going back to Earth. Sweet. Stay in school. <laughs> Sucker, I don't go to school, so... Okay. Oh. Flashbacks? That- the pig from the third game? Is that the- We'll stick around after the credits to see your time. That was the random pig from the credits in the third game. What the heck? The one you got- Absolutely murdered by road signs. Riddle score five. That was fun. You beat the game in 45 minutes, 27 seconds, and 20. I don't get. Dissy seconds. 45 minutes, 27 seconds, and. 17 mini second disseconds. You unlock special features. Cool. Back to main menu. 45 minutes. Wow, that took special features. Okay. I guess this just takes you to the other games. Top three biggest miss on misconceptions. There are several things about the series that people just can't seem to understand. Don't have a clue what just happened. That real school five storyline is far fetched. Perhaps this section will help you make sense of it or not. Retrospective thoughts process of the series. Rejected riddle games. Okay. I'm not gonna read these because the video is already long enough, but you can read them. Two grounds is a free thing. Anyway, so. Thank you all so much for watching, I'll do the next game, I think it's called Riddle Transfer soon, and thank you all so much for watching, can't wait to do that, um, leave a like, subscribe on the, to my channel, and hit the notification bell icon so you get notified in all my latest videos. Anyway, I'm gonna play with this for a while.